Khloe Kardashian recently sparked rumors she'd gone under the knife after debuting an almost unrecognizable version of herself in an Instagram selfie. Although it very well may be some serious Photoshop, we can't deny the reality star has had quite the transformation. This shocking selfie isn't the first time Khloe has been accused of having work done. Over the years, she's worked hard to get a brand new bod and had serious glow up altogether, leaving fans curious if she's gotten plastic surgery. Khloe Kardashian is a media personality, reality TV star, socialite, and more who's also mom to daughter True. Her baby daddy, Tristan Thompson, she's had and is still having her fair share of drama with because it's never clear whether they're over or not. I heard they're quarantining together and not to mention he was also quickly caught leaving flirty comments on the viral selfie she posted a few days ago. Despite having a baby, Chloe has come out in even better shape than before, rocking abs and doing intense workouts on the daily. She credits this mega weight loss for her transformation, stating that since she slimmed down, she got a whole new look even in her face. While I kind of believe that it's also hard to imagine the 35 Five year old had no help from cosmetic work. In this latest selfie, Chloe not only looks like she's a new nose, it looks like a whole new face. There are even memes circling the internet about how most of us can't even get paper towels during quarantine, but Chloe can have her plastic surgeon on call. One thing's for sure, surgery or not, Chloe can no longer be called the fat Kardashian sister, and those rude jokes should be far behind her. What's going on, guys and girls? My name is Kara, and this series we've titled Before and After. We're gonna be taking a look at Chloe Kardashian and her mega transformation over the last little while, including what plastic surgery she's had done, if any, her inspiring weight loss and more. We already had a before and after for her on this channel, but considering she's changed a lot since then, especially after that recent selfie, it was time for an update. I've also done other celebrity transformation videos in the likes of Summer, Walker, and Adele, and we'll link to some at the end. If you like this channel, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post so you never miss out. As always, if there's anyone else you want me to document, let me know in the comments down below. And be sure to follow me on Instagram because I love connecting with you guys. Now let's get into this video. Chloe is definitely a celebrity who's gone through quite the physical metamorphosis over the years, and not to say she wasn't beautiful before, but she really had an impressive glow up. In the early days, Chloe often found herself being called the fat sister, which she's opened up about. In a past interview, she said, It's so funny because I didn't think I was that sister. I didn't think I was the fat sister until people would call me that. And I was like, am I? Like, I just didn't really think of myself as being fat. And she really wasn't. There are just people out there looking for something to criticize. I died in 2000. Three. I was 19. And when it set in, I was like, you spiral. And for me, my spiral was food. So with Chloe's ups and downs over the years, be it family problems, divorce, and other publicized drama, she did admit to having a struggle with food. She never thought of herself as fat, but realized she was unhealthy and wanted to start making healthier choices. She also said that when people labeled her the fat sister, she would deflect hurtful comments by saying she's big boned, and that was her way of not letting it get to her. Looking at photos of her body before, it seems Chloe's weight actually fluctuated quite a bit. It wasn't until recent years, and most noticeably after having her baby, that she got into the best shape of her life. Chloe said about her weight transformation, Never would I ever consider myself fat, but I would consider myself unhealthy, mentally, physically, and not knowing my true value, mind, body, and soul. For me, my transformation journey started from within. I needed to heal myself from the inside out. Once I started putting myself first, everything started falling into place. In the end, Chloe is the one having the last laugh with all of her haters. Not only did she have a show revenge body, she also released a book, Strong Looks Better Naked. She's always keeping up with her dedicated workout schedule, but I'll talk more about that a little later on. Aside from losing 40 pounds or more, before Chloe had a different look altogether. She had dark hair and not the blonde hair she's had for quite some time now. In the early days, it seems her face was much rounder too. She had a wider nose and smaller lips. Not to mention when you compare photos of her face from before to recent ones, Chloe looks as if her eyebrows and eye area are more lifted and awake if you will. Now that this recent photo of Chloe has gone viral thanks to how different she looks, we can only wonder what cosmetic work did the reality star have done? Let's take a look at Chloe's face. Since her split with Tristan, rumors have constantly swirled that she turned to plastic surgery to get back her revenge look with one gossip site even claiming she's blown one million dollars on plastic surgery. And with that new photo, the rumors are only continuing. 
First of all, it was said more than once that Chloe has gotten a nose job. In the early days, the bridge of her nose appeared much wider and just looks a lot less sleek than it does recently. She's credited these changes to her weight loss, saying her nose slimmed down too, but in some instances it's more believable than others. After posting a photo to Instagram in 2018, Chloe's nose looked a lot slimmer than usual, and fans wasted no time asking if she got a rhinoplasty. Chloe adamantly denies she got a nose job though and has said, one day I think I'll get one because I think about it every day, but I'm scared so for now it's all about contour. And while that could be true, pictures tell a bit of a different story. Looking at photos of Chloe's nose before and after side by side, it looks like there are significant changes depending on what angle you look at it. Contour can help, but it certainly can't make your nose point upwards. In some pics, not only is Chloe's nose slimmer and sleeker, it also appears to have the tip lifted before it was more flat. But I'll let you guys be the judge. I also noticed Chloe's eye area looks a lot different than before. Her eyebrows and eye area is generally more lifted, giving her more of a cat eye look at times and bringing her eyebrows higher up off her eyelid area. Although there are surgical eye lifts she could have had done, fillers in the area are much more common these days and promise similar results. We know that it's a possibility Chloe's had some fillers there because she's admitted to getting some before, but they messed up her face and she had to have them dissolved apparently. I don't know if it's Botox or filler. Like I don't, everyone says, well, which one? I did one of them. My whole face went numb and I could not make, oh. I had to dissolve everything. This suggests that Chloe doesn't like fillers and doesn't get them in her face anymore, but one source told the tabloid about Chloe. Not a month goes by that she doesn't go to her clinic for mega doses of Botox, collagen, and laser resurfacing, and she pays several thousand a session in order to get the best quality work. But who knows if that's true. I personally think that since Chloe lost a lot of weight, she would have more sagging skin and wrinkles if she didn't get any fillers or work done, especially since she's in her mid-30s. However, she claims to swear by great laser treatments. Chloe said, Let me set the record straight, once and for all. I haven't had any fillers or done any plastic surgery, yet, lol. But I do believe in a great laser treatment. I do lasers all the time. Lasers for skin unevenness, skin tightening, stretch marks, scars, acne. And whether or not Chloe gets fillers in her face, we do know she's admitted to getting her lips done in the past. Looking at pics from then and now, it's clear that these days her pout is much fuller, at times looking a little frozen, probably shortly after she's gotten them injected. But plenty of celebs and non-celebs alike get lip injections these days, so it doesn't seem like that big of a deal to me. Although Chloe has truly adopted an all new look over the last few years, this latest jaw dropping change in her Instagram selfie is likely more because of Photoshop and Facetune rather than plastic surgery, and fans spotted some dead giveaways that proved it. Apparently half of Chloe's necklace chain is missing in her selfie and fans caught it pretty quickly. One commenter said, First of all, Chloe Kardashian gave herself an entire new face. She took touching up to an entire new level. Second of all, she forgot to Photoshop her necklace chain too. Girlie, you ain't fooling anybody. I guess while Chloe airbrushed her jawline or neck, she erased some necklace too. Who knows, but whatever she did, it had everyone speculating, that's for sure. While it's hard to deny Chloe hasn't gotten a nose job or Botox and fillers to change the look of her face, this time we might just be able to write it off as Photoshop. Now for Chloe's body. It's no surprise that her weight loss changed her look the most, and while people have accused her of getting cosmetic help, it's mostly the result of hard work and dedication. Just the other day, Chloe posted one of her quarantine workouts, sharing a clip on Instagram of herself pulling a cart with the strength of her tiny waist running along her streets. To make the task even more difficult, her two-year-old daughter True rode in the wagon, and Chloe looked incredible in her workout outfit. If they are wanting to build, they have to make sure they're consuming the right amount of food. And you should always eat about 30 minutes after your workouts. If you want to build specifically, you should be eating tons of protein. It's no doubt that Chloe has made lifestyle changes to get the dream body she has these days, and it wasn't easy. Although she was on a stricter diet while initially trying weights, she has reached her goal of around 100 pounds and now focuses mostly on committed exercise rather than diet. When she gave birth, Chloe was 203 pounds, so she shed a ton of weight and looks amazing. Before she had a baby, fans were already accusing her of getting lipo too, to which Chloe responded, I find it disgusting, but maybe a compliment that I'm being accused of getting lipo done. I work out five days a week, I bust my ass. Although there's always a possibility Chloe got help with lipo to get her toned and flat stomach, it sounds like her rock hard abs are the result of training. Though 
the number on the scale fluctuates a little, Chloe says she's maintained her 60 pound weight loss during the pandemic by regular exercise. In the past, her personal trainer said she did strength sessions, boxing circuits, and medicine ball workouts in the gym, and all she's still probably putting in the time daily at her home gym, Chloe also uses her daughter True like a weight such as when she carries her during her walks or the wagon exercise. Chloe's also been jumping rope for 30 minutes a day and using her treadmill. Chloe's waist is much tinier than ever before, but she credits this to a waist trainer as well, which we've seen her using more than once. Finally, the only other area on Chloe's body she may have had some work done is her butt. After giving birth to her daughter, photos surfaced of Chloe showing off what fans said was a fake butt. Although she's always had curves by the looks of that butt, it's hard to believe it's all natural. What do you guys think? Personally, judging by the shape and comparing pics from then and now, it looks like Chloe's had a Brazilian butt lift where they transfer fat from other areas of the body to the booty. This is also the same procedure we know her sisters like Kim and Kylie are clearly fans of, so I wouldn't be surprised. Alright guys and girls, that wraps up this video here on Before and After. I think we can all agree that Khloe Kardashian is one of the Kardashian-Jenner sisters who's changed the most over the years, from her face changes to weight loss and even her hair color. And in regards to the Instagram picture that everyone's talking about, we can all agree that Chloe looks drastically different. Whether it's from plastic surgery, heavy face tune, or both, it's not the first time a Kardashian Jenner sister has been thrown under the bus for this, and it likely won't be the last. Anyway, you spin it, it's Chloe's face and her Instagram, and she can do whatever makes her happy. But I want to hear from you guys. What do you guys think about Chloe's transformation? Was there anything I missed? You let me know you know where, as well as who else I should do a before and after on. If you want to talk more, you can hit me up on Instagram. Be sure to hit subscribe and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!